Okay, so we're checking out the only game where you get to hit the earth with a nuke literally the size of the earth. It's ICBM. ICBM is one of those games that's supposed to be like real time where you're developing missiles and all that stuff. Boring! Right over here, you'll notice that there are such bombs as the 10 megaton bomb. And in fact, there's even a 50 megaton bomb that you can get. But do you know what we call those? Rookie numbers. This is a game where you can literally just edit any part of the entire game, like including the bombs, like everything about the bombs. So since there are such things as this boosted fission weapon, and since we can make them do things that are theoretically impossible, I wanna see if we can eventually destroy the entire planet with a nuke the size of the planet. There's something else I wanna do too. After we increase the strength of the nukes to the point where one single nuke can destroy the entire solar system, I'm gonna give everyone in the entire game all the time and all the weapons that they need and I want to see who will fire the very first planetary solar system black hole creating nuke. The best thing about this game is you can watch as the entire planet melts itself like a sad ice cream cone. There's also death tolls for everything that happens. Okay, so here's the megaton bomb. I don't really have anything against Havana, but it's close. So we're gonna bomb it just to give you an idea of where the power level of the current bomb sits at. Actually, you know what? I got two air bases. There's no reason not to bomb things twice. Here's a regular nuclear bomb. Santa Domingo, you got 2.2 million test subjects. Alrighty, now you can see as our bombers over here start moving across the ocean. Everything's nice. New Orleans is like, Gray, what the fuck are you doing? When all of a sudden, Air Gray decides to land like this. And. Bloop! See that? 101,000 people dead. Rookie numbers. I'm not gonna be satisfied until we increase the power level of the warheads enough so that we can wipe out all life on the planet. In fact, if possible, I want to actually erase the planet from the game. All right, let's see if this other bomb is any better because the other one was pretty damn weak. Okay, uh, if anything, I guess maybe the cloud is taller. Holy Jesus, half a million people dead. Now we're getting somewhere. Still though, like I said, rookie numbers. Okay, the first, the first problem here is you do not get enough points to actually do what we want to do, so... Alrighty, let's see here. Okay, cruise missiles, yeah. Available points, negative one, no. How about one with a lot of zeros after it? See this? That's what I'm talking about. Um, uh, yeah, go ahead and give me all that. Excellent. Gray, how many missile silos would you like? All the missile silos. Uh, yeah, all these. Okay, now with that at our disposal, go over here to missiles. Guided bomb, low power nuclear bomb. No, 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 yeah. I like how there's a thing here for precision. Does it really matter when we're gonna blow up half of the entire planet? Draw size, what's being drawn? Is it the size of the missile? Whatever, let's add some zeros and see what happens. I love how there's literally a file that you can mess with in the game called explosion. <laughs> you can change the volume of the explosion. Kilotons, yes. Damage, yes. Don't wanna go too crazy yet. Range, all of it. Uh, full effect range, sure. Draw size, times 10. Pollution size, <laughs> here's your climate change. Time growing? What the hell does this mean? This is like the, the bomb slowly becoming erect into the sky? Whatever, yeah, make it slightly longer. Eventually what I'm gonna do is change all the weapons so that all hell breaks loose on the planet. <laughs> Since I'm from Florida, can I put all of the tactical nuclear silos there? How, how many can I shove in here? <laughs> yes. <laughs> can I get like a few more on the coast? <laughs> Everyone here gets to enjoy the beach. Uh, yeah, all these. Oh, I get to put some up in Canada, too. Fantastic. You understand this is not the way the game is meant to be played, but none of us really care. Diplomacy. No. All right, uh, first things first. Where's the big-ass bombs at? Uh-huh, no, 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 yes. Yeah, just make all these. In fact, focus all of your efforts on it. All right. Well, now I just have to uh, wait for a few minutes here. Okay, now that we have the bomb of stupidity ready, we get to see what it does. Yeah, give me the good bomb. I don't want to detonate this too close to where I live, so uh, I love you, Paris. <laughs> now, don't you worry. I mean, we only increase the power of the bomb like 10 or 100 or 1,000 times. 
It may not be that bad, okay? I'm sure Paris will be just- Is this the bomb so oh my god! <laughs> That's the draw size! The bomb is this- so look at the size of the damn thing! If you turn it this way, it looks like the Earth is wearing a red pair of sunglasses. Or it's just like really angry. The Earth's like, Nani? Oh, this is probably the time that it takes to hit pa <gasps> Holy Christ! <laughs> Look at the size of the cloud! <laughs> what the hell happened to the planet? <laughs> Holy sh- Shows you all the different cities when they're burned to the ground. 2.14 billion people dead in London. I don't think London had that many people. It had to like spawn extra humans just so they could die. <laughs> we don't start wars, but we end them by being cheating bastards. Kind of curious what, uh, oh my God. <laughs> this is all the stuff that got destroyed by the bone. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh no! Did it reach all the way over to the United States? I'm pretty sure that uh, the death count is like 100% Phoenix, damn it. Maybe that's, maybe that's a different Phoenix. The death toll never ends, I'm still scrolling. How is anyone researching anything? There shouldn't be anyone left alive. Okay, hold on, we, we may need to mess around with like the color coordination of the game a little bit here. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll chill out on the draw size. Before I go completely ballistic, hold on. What, happen what happens if I bring this down a little bit? Like how I wanted to go small in the beginning. Always make sure to save often. I'm giving Canada all the power this time. There's gonna be a missile silo across from every single Tim Hortons. New strike plan. Allow overkill. Targets. Cities. I love that you can change the name of your plan. Since they're all coming from Canada, it's Canada Mageddon. Enjoy. Execute Canada Mageddon. Look at how many arrows! Oh my god, let the bombing come. <laughs> <laughs> Look at how ridiculous this can get! Now all these bombs are uh, pretty weak, fairly weak bombs, so this- this- Oh my god! I was gonna say this shouldn't be that bad! Poor Havana. We are a bunch of vicious bastards. A city has been bombed. Yeah, I know. All right, let's see how the populations are doing. Africa still has 66%, 61, 58. Oh, there's still plenty of people around here. That's right, boys. Keep lighting it up, because we got a few seconds before we can release the Kraken. Alrighty. Well, the warhead is prepared. It's going down to Buenos Aires. Alrighty, and there goes one of the layers of hell. Now, if you look, this bomb is much more normal sized. And there's the explosion. <laughs> oh yeah. Bomb size is way more normal. Honestly, that's a pretty weak bomb. I think that we're gonna have to like move things farther than we were before because I wanna see this cloud, but I wanna see it bigger than the entire planet. All right, draw size that much. Just like how we were able to shoot off like 30 nukes at a time. I gotta find out what the name of those files are and then change it so that in the end We can fire all those with the stats of the big nuke I'm slowly starting to move further and further away from North America just to see if I can keep us alive But we keep increasing the damage potential so much that there's probably no way in hell. All right, Istanbul You're the next test subject. Just gotta find out Holy shit! Look at the size of the death cloud! You can't even see the planet! That looks like everyone was hit. Population. Zero. Will will the will the smoke eventually clear? Oh. Oh, I think it's I think it's going away. There we go. Everything's fine. Heads three. Wait, can I change how many extra missiles these things shoot? 300. <laughs> Production cost. 0 0.1. Oh, let me change this one too, just in case. 400 warheads. Yeah, let's increase the draw size a little bit. Okay, the explosion is nuke 1000. Right here it is. <laughs> All right, I don't want to go too crazy here. Just increase the damage by 10. Range, yeah, sure. Okay, 
Let's try this now. I don't need to waste my time with the big bombs anymore since I can just make these forever and just change how good they are. I'm about to vomit nukes over the entire planet. Nukes on tons of meth and steroids. Execute Plan Armageddon. Behold the urine streams of death. All right, now all these bombs have been enhanced, like, a lot. <laughs> Jesus, they cause mushroom clouds just from being fired. I need to mess with the draw size of these so they're all, like, the size of the screen. Oh, this is cool. I gave the Earth a comb over. Look, I'm just waiting for that very first one to touch down. It takes a while here. All right, they're starting to split. Now, is each explosion stupidly big? Look at how many. And... Oh, my God. There's still stuff exploding. <laughs> Okay, let's see here. Most of the cities are still okay. For the first time ever, <laughs> we're alive over here in, you know, Florida. Okay, the stupid sized nukes are starting to pop up all over the planet finally. Okay, I felt like we hadn't really gotten stupid enough in quite some time. Like all the bombs are just kind of, you know, big, but not really big. So I decided to increase it a little bit more. And on top of that, I've got all of the planes with the megaton bombs, but they're gonna do a synchronized attack. So they're all gonna hit at exactly the same time. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. All right, all the bombs are going down. And there it is. Now you get to see some stupidity. It actually doesn't look that bad. I may have to increase the draw size even a little bit more. I mean, if you look at the planet, it's got like the worst case of acne ever. How many people died? Yes. I gotta mention too, the mushroom clouds go like a thousand miles into the air. I just want to see what diplomacy does. Hey, South America do- <laughs> Rejected? You bastards. You're gonna regret that. Does anyone want to join me? Rejected. Come on, Russia. Alliance Aha, we're part of the Red Alliance with Russia. Russia, you, you will be spared. Hold on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna share my nuclear assets with Russia. Maybe they can use these nukes to good effect. Does anyone else want to be part of the blue team? Right, I want to see what Russia does because I've given them access to all the nukes that we have. Anything they want to use, they can use. Oh, we've got more alliances going on here. South America is te teaming up with East Asia, Europe and West Asia, and Pacific and Africa. Pacific wants to join the alliance. Yeah, absolutely. We're all gonna die anyway because my nukes go halfway across the planet. I actually want to know who's gonna drop the first bomb because right now I've got it set so that the bombs will instantaneously kill us all. There's like a giant friggin' military spat going on over here with the boats. It's like a giant slap fight. Everyone's just calling each other bitch. Yeah, I wanna share all my nuclear assets with everyone. Okay, 34 minutes have gone by and no one's actually killed one another yet. Have there been any deaths at all? What are you guys doing? I would have melted the planet by now. Come on, whoever gets the first nuke wins. I'm not even gonna do anything this time around. What is that sound? I know the sound of missiles launching when I hear it. What the hell's going on over here? Are you guys parking your damn carriers on top of one another? Okay, no one has built a missile silo yet. Yeah, why not, Africa? Come on in. All right. Pacific is starting to learn the boosted fission weapon. That's good. Okay, South America has a missile silo. Since everyone's just screwing around, I guess I'll make more of these. The first place to actually build a nuke is Africa. Europe has like no technologies available. What the hell are you doing over there, Europe? You're not doing anything. The ones with the most technology, Russia. So, um, Europe was lagging behind forever. They were the first ones to release the nukes. It took forever to finally get this to happen. It took three hours. I don't know what happened. They're the only ones that cared enough to actually blow up the planet. I don't know how they did it, but the population of South Asia is now negative 1,433%. I just had to check two for two to see if it would be Europe again. It's Europe every damn time. Look at the size of the mushroom cloud. I'm getting cancer through my computer screen. I feel like I need more damage. There we go. Might as well make the draw size, uh, yeah, that much. All right, rain fire. Just do it. <laughs> 
There we go. That's what I wanted. Look at the size of the class. <laughs> the fire goes all the way to the moon. We're still dropping bombs too. <laughs> oh God, I <laughs> look at it. I think what's amazing to me is there's still like, not quite 50% of the population of the planet left. Well, there's no one left in Europe, I guess. All the bombers are coming back just so that they can do this again. Hoop. We don't do anything the normal way. Here, have some more bombers. There you go. Can't run out of mushroom clouds after all. All right, how's that population doing? All right, let's see, uh, yeah. Europe's gone, South America's down to 16%, Russia's down to 19%. <laughs> Clearly we haven't done enough damage yet if people are still, you know what, I might as well kill myself too. Yeah, range all of it. Uh-huh, draw size, let's go nuts. Pollution size. All right, all the bombers should be full up on bombs. Execute the plan. 35, 25, 10. I might as well zoom all the way out for this. Five, four, three, here we go. Two, one. <laughs> the achievement is no mercy. <laughs> oh my God. How the hell do you have negative 6,100% left? His score is negative 600,000. The world is in ruins. Game over. Well, everyone, hope you enjoyed this episode of ICPM. <laughs> Till the next time. Negative 2 billion points. Stay foxy and much love.